A blood drive held on Assumptions campus today encouraged students to be the quote light in the darkness of the world. The school says while their blood donations are unlikely to help victims in Las Vegas, their generosity will help someone in need locally. Our Brittany Schaefer joins us live now with more on how students are giving back after the deadly Vegas shooting. Brittany. Olivia, students I spoke to say giving blood takes a quick and easy 10 minutes. And with the Las Vegas shooting and the devastating hurricanes, they needed to do something. The American Red Cross of Massachusetts says hundreds of people are donating blood following the tragedy in Las Vegas. We get to see the good side of people after these types of events happen. Um, there are almost always a lot of people that come out and they want to help. They want to do something. And I know there's been a big call for blood in Las Vegas and even all the way across the country, people are responding to that. They're hearing that and coming out to donate. So we really appreciate it. It was the driving factor for many students who are part of Assumption College's first blood drive of the year. Obviously with the hurricanes going on in Las Vegas and Puerto Rico, uh, it's kind of my civic duty. My slight sting in my arm is nothing compared to what other people are going through in the world. I just saw the signs outside and you know the tragedy that happened in Las Vegas. And it was just such a sad thing, so I uh, felt that I could do my part to help. Among the 59 confirmed dead in Sunday's mass shooting is 2005 Assumption graduate student Sandy Casey. Junior Benjamin Alzamora says the campus is mourning. It's so sad, and uh, I didn't know her. It doesn't take away from the fact that she didn't deserve it the way she did. And, it's just a truly sad thing. Organizers of the blood drive say the large turnout was more than expected and shows volumes about the Assumption community and uniting together. Right now there are so many things happening throughout the world. It's a very difficult time, but we're lucky because we have the opportunity to help all of these people. I just feel like I'm truly proud of my school and uh, hope we can rally around and help Las Vegas out and all the people who need blood today. Now, the Red Cross says they've given a large amount of blood donations to Las Vegas. Therefore, the new donations will be used to restock their supply. Olivia? All right, Brittany.